This episode was actually damn disturbing. What's good, y'all? Main man, Master here. Leave the Master Nets on the round table. Come with one here. That's the move. Subscribe to this big move for another one. Mm hmm. And, Made of this. Season 2, Episode 3. Now, when it comes to this, right? I knew going into this that Made of this does walk that line where. Well, last week we had the hair on the ass episode, so. But. Actually, y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm going to do this a little differently this time, so I'm jump straight into it. There was the part in the middle where the pink bastard, I'm going to try to kill me, picked it up and squeezed the light out of it. First of all, what kind of bastard does that to a living thing? You look at it like the car motion or something. Is that how you test the value? Test your mic. No! So in a way, the repercussions of that, honestly, you really shouldn't feel that bad for. It's just the fact that the way they had it done, because this thing, this animal thing, First of all, only said my over and over again that was already like, you know, mm -hmm. so we could tell by the bargaining system in this world that things that hold value are very valuable for those shit, right? But when it was, had its valuable stolen right from underneath it or inside it, I don't know how things work around here. You put things anywhere nowadays. Is that made a bitch joke or a life joke? That weird. And when it was getting that stuff taken away from it, this thing was breaking down, crying like it was just losing pieces of its soul or something. And yeah, in some cases, maybe that could have been heart wrenching. But what happened afterwards? Kind of reminded me of some JoJo shit, actually. Anybody went here watching Stone Ocean, where they was making best overthrowing that ball, where they didn't have the monetary gain, they had the loose organs and flesh. And that kind of happened here where they just tore off this thing's arms and started ripping off some of his skin. Ugh, skin crawling, y'all. Like I said, we're not exactly in a space where we didn't know we made the biscuit can take it there. It's just the fact that, uh, it's been some time made the biscuit. Kind of forgot made the biscuit. And then that goes back into the system we was talking about. Because right before that scene happened, we was having freaking, we could talk to these guys about trying to bargain or sell something. And they even talk about selling yourself. First of all, logically, that always make no sense. How the hell am I sell myself for something I want? That, that, that's kind of what's going to happen then. And they started getting into details, talking about the skin, the hair, the organs. Actually, they kind of like it as a whole thing. I mean, we're just going to sell you rags and arm, but you're talking about human flesh? God, I'm not the only one that's just screaming to get out of here, right? What did we come here for again? Cause that's two episodes now, like every fiber of my being is kind of just telling me we need to get the hell up out of here. Then it was the hotel scene, they was eating that soup. <laughs> Homegirl just, mm. just gonna be on talking all day, huh? At least we didn't have to watch it this time. But yeah, this whole episode was just like, what the fuck? Well, I'm glad to see the home team again, or the Suicide Squad as they put it. I forgot the names, y'all, I'm sorry. But that didn't make it no much easier because Last episode, we already went through the motions of this place is dangerous. These guys walk in here, and the first thing they get right there in the episode is a big ass monster, a bunch of heads eating somebody that was tearing them through the. This is not a good setup. This is not. This. That's gonna be the wave I'm on to we get out of this bitch. They named the whole season after it. I'm glad this was one of the moments where I wasn't eating when I watched this episode. I was waiting on some food though. DoorDash, a piece of trash. Talk about it squeezing so some of this guts was coming out of his ass and had to pop one of his eyes back in. I see some complaints online about how people, you know, the big thing walking around is the CG revolving around that, even though it's technically just a vessel. There been some complaints about that. That's the thing y'all worry about. But yeah, man, very made in the best type made in the best episode this week, huh? Not that I would expect this from nowhere else, but I'm surprised when I shouldn't be. I really don't know how to rate this one. Damn. Thanks for watching. Let's be in the comments what you think. Like this video for me and I will see y'all. Peace out. Good luck.